शिक्षण क्षेत्र में तनदे छापन मुड़ी उड़पिया सेंट मेरी इंग्लिश मीडियम शाल प्ले स्कूल विभाग शाल संचालक फद चार मेनेजर्स उद्घाटी आशीर्वाद नूतन प्ले स्कूल विभाग आशीर्वचन फद चार मेनेजर्स हलवर आसे आकांक्षी निम्बे शाल करेतरी निम्ब मूर्ण आरइक बेद शिक्षण प्रयत्न नमु मकुमु नमें इष्टवे भगवंत अष्टपड़ताने आशीर्वदाने शाला प्रांशुपाल फादर जॉन्सन सिक्वेर प्रास्तविक मतुगड़ सेंट मेरी प्ले स्कूल विभाग तरगति पुट मकल के मनसुगे इष्ट चित्र कंगोलू पुटाणी के विश्रांति कोठड़ी आटद परकर लभ्य है मोदी दिन पुटाणी रिब्बन कूलक प्ले स्कूल के चालन सदर्भली शाला कोठड़ी सुंदर वाली वर्ण चित्र सुंदरीक शाला कला शिक्षक जगदीश आचार्य प्ले स्कूल शिक्षक नाजिया बानु रेणिटा डि आलमेड दैहिक शिक्षक जेरा इवर शाला संचालक गौरव कार्यक्रम चर्च पालना मंडलिया उपाध्यक्ष मैक्सीम डिसोजा शाला उप प्रांशुपाल रीटा क्वाड्रस् को आर्डिनेटर राजश्री नायक व्यार्थी पोषक उपस्थितर this has been a dream come true for all of us and uh, those who were looking for this day the time has arrived for your children to be catered to in the school here uh, as father said you will have a lot of expectations as a lot of anxiety also because leaving little children in the school what will happen what will go right and wrong these questions will arise in you but for a long but better future we need to invest somewhere in the beginning itself and you have right to make the right decision i believe and uh, accordingly the children will be taken care here and they will be made to study what they require for their future uh, for a better future they are already who are at work now <laughs> and many more will be joining him in the days to come nothing to worry about because that is what we are expected in the gospel reading what i read many people will shout at them that the children are doing these things but jesus said let them be like that because that is their children of god kingdom of god is children and that is why children will do many things which will be may not be liked by us but god will like them and that's why god will bless them with this uh, thoughts we need to take care of the children here i wish all the very best to you there will be little uh, little harder days in the beginning to send your children here leave them here and we will uh, i'll ask father johnson to provide one more room when you come here which the children are not staying here but then you will have to stay somewhere your parents will have to stay for some time somewhere <laughs> and for that you might be, need one more room so that you are here and you can take the children back when the time is up anyway uh, you have come forward with all the enthusiasm we wish that uh, your dreams come true and we pray that your children may be uh, trained well and learn well so that in the days to come they will fare well and they will have a lot of stories to share and you will have a lot of stories to share about your children to all uh, near and dear ones t23 is a day of remembrance for all of us it's a day of thanksgiving as we thank god for blessing us with various blessings and spe and especially today in the form of the establishment of saint mary's play school in our premises it's a day to cherish the realization of long awaited dream of all of us with the introduction of saint mary's play school we are becoming a full pledged cbs school as per the recommendations of national education policy 2020 at the very outset my heart goes out in gratitude to correspondent very reverend father charles minages who not only gave us the permission but also the direction 
and the ideas to establish play school within the existing building. All the best of the things have been provided to the toddlers in the days to come. Thank you, dear Father, for being with us, supporting all our endeavors in this uh, St. Mary's School. We know it is a temporary arrangement for the play school. Within a year or two, we will be having a separate independent building for the kindergarten section. And we thank Father for his hard work, for his labor, for the development of St. Mary's. A big round of applause to you, Father. They said, if we want our children to move mountains, we first have to let them get out of their chairs. It's a memorable day for all the parents, as well as for the toddlers. The little children may not understand what we speak today, what we discuss today, but the parents do. And for all these little children, it is the first day of their formal education. I know parents are here with a lot of expectations from their kids from the school. Parents have a lot of dreams for their children. And it is obvious that in order to achieve the dreams that you have for your kids, the children will have to move out of their comfort zone. So far, they were with you, listening to your stories, listening to your songs, troubling you here and there. And you might have told, let me put once to the school and then I will be free. And today is the day where your dream will be realized. Formally, you will be admitting your child to the school. And we know, though you have said that I will put in the school, it's going to be a painful uh, thing for you today. You may, you may feel a little different at home. As you leave your children here and go back, you will find that something is missing at home. Surely you will miss the fun, the laughter, the naughtiness of your kids. But a kind of separation, the temporary separation is required because we want the children to move mountains. We want the children to reach good heights. So in order to achieve it, they need to move out of their comfort zone. And so they, they are here. And dear parents, thank you for reposing your faith in St. Mary's and admitting your kids. As of today, we have altogether 41 students for the uh, play school and we wish all the parents best wishes for the